Again, guys, do not try this at home. I have full safety, so. But this is what happens when you throw a frozen food and try to fry it. Let's check it out. So this is what ivory soap looks like. It's only a dollar for three bars of soap. What you're gonna find out about this soap, it's really light and like, let's break it. You see? It's almost like cream. So let's put it in a microwave and let's see what happens. So we're gonna put this bar of soap right here and then close it and let's see what happens. You see the soap becomes alive. Look how crazy is that. Isn't it insane? Why is it happening? Pretty much every soap is actually have a lot of air holes over there like air spots so that's why air heats up and expands that's why like you know ivory soap is just blowing up like that because it have a lot a lot a lot of air inside of the bar of soap like like i mean air bubbles and so once we heat it up heat it up the air is expanding air bubbles and that's what happening with the soap pretty insane huh it smells like soap definitely all right we're gonna turn it off and let's see what happens look we have a lot of cream over here a lot of it all right and if we touch it, look, it just expanded soap. It's pretty warm, so be careful. Let it cool off. But yeah, you see, it was just air inside of it. That's why. And there's more. Oh, yeah. If we microwave it longer, it would have expanded even more. You see this the main part of the soap. But you can still wash hands with that. But yeah. Pretty cool experiments. What do you guys think? We're gonna check how durable the balloons are really are. Let's check it out. All right, guys. I got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine balloons, and then I'm gonna put this coffee table on top of balloons. And guess what? They did not pop, even though this table is pretty heavy. Talking about weight distribution, but that's not epic enough. I'm gonna stand on top of it and see if they're gonna pop or not. Try to gonna distribute my weight on the whole thing. And you see, my hands are right here. I'm standing just on the balloons. That's it. And they do not pop. How crazy is that? You see how wobbly I am? Whoa, I'm trying to get, grab you guys over here. So you can see, you see how they sticking out from the side, over there and over here, and over there, and whoa, it's really wobbly, but they do not pop. How is it possible? You know how balloons, how, how tiny they are, and now I'm going to try to jump on them, and you see, they still do not pop. Alright, I'm gonna get off. Woo! And guess what? Balloons all alive, all alive, not popped. And if I've, I'm jump, just gonna jump on one, like this one, look at this. And they just pop. But if like whole bunch of them together, weight distribution, and they're a lot stronger together.
put the whole bottle of Coca-Cola in there. As you can see, it's fizzing, it's a normal Coca-Cola. It's black as well. Okay. Now we're gonna put the filter back on. And you see this filter is set as a water bottle. So it will be awesome in a survival situation. Then we're gonna open it. This is like water bottle. And just pour it. And let's see what happens. Okay. Nothing happening. Oh, I have to open it all the way. And look at this. Coca-Cola turns into water. How amazing is that? And guess what's gonna happen? It turns, turns in, in water pretty much. Look at it. And now I'm just gonna pour. And you see, it turns into water. 